A lot of people think that Thomas Alva Edison invented the light bulb, but he didn't. It was actually Joseph Swan, a British scientist and inventor. The first house in the world that was lightened up by a commercially usable light bulb was not the house of Edison, it was the house of Joseph Swan. In 1878, Swan presented his light bulb at a lecture, at the same time when Edison started working on his light bulb. Edison's light bulb was merely an improvement on Swan's inventions. This was not the first time Edison tried to take the credit of an original inventor, but this time Joseph Swan sued him and nearly won the case. But if Swan won, why do most people credit Edison as the inventor of the light bulb instead of Swan? What actually happened will blow your mind. Swan started working on his light bulb almost 30 years before Edison even thought of working on it. In 1850, Swan began working on the carbon filaments. By 1860, he was the first person to prove that it was possible to produce light by putting carbonized paper filaments in an evacuated glass bulb. But it was too early. The purpose of a vacuum in a light bulb is to not provide oxygen to the filament so that it doesn't get burned. But the vacuum at that time wasn't strong enough, so it wasn't possible to create a practical light bulb. In 1865, Hermann Sprenzel invented a vacuum pump that could create the strongest vacuum at that time, strong enough to create a light bulb. But this time, Joseph Swan was busy working on other inventions for almost 10 years. In 1875, he started working on the light bulb again. By 1878, Swan had invented the first commercially usable light bulb. He managed to make the filament glow unbelievably white without catching fire. He presented his light bulb at a lecture, but due to some problem, the light bulb broke down after a few minutes during the lecture. Although Swan had solved the problem with the vacuum, but the filament was still not good enough. The light bulb often broke down due to excessive current, so he concentrated on solving the filament problem and finding a better way to attach the ends. On November 27, 1880, he obtained a British patent for inventing a method of treating cotton to produce parchmentized thread, which solved the problem. Since then, he began installing light bulbs in homes and public places. The Lit and Feel Library in Westgate Road, Newcastle, became the first public room lit by an electric light bulb during a lecture by Swan on 20th October 1880. In the next year, he started his company and started commercial production. At the same time, Edison started selling his light bulbs. Although Swan and Edison did their research independently, both patented their light bulbs almost at the same time. Edison started working on his light bulb in 1878. He started his experiments with a carbonized filament made of cardboard. This burnt out too quickly. Then he continued his experiments with several materials including platinum, different grasses, and canes. Platinum was too expensive to commercialize. The other ones didn't work. He continued his experiments before realizing that bamboo was the best filament. A carbonized bamboo filament could last more than 1200 hours. The Edison Electric Light Company was formed in 1878. In December 1879, Edison demonstrated his light bulb for the first time, one year after Swan presented his light bulb. At that time, Edison famously said, We will make electricity so cheap that only the rich will burn candles. Edison had to face several lawsuits regarding his light bulb. One such was the lawsuit filed by Joseph Swan. Swan sued Edison in the UK in 1882 and his claims were upheld by the British court. Edison sued Swan back claiming his invention was prior. However, Swan's claims were stronger and Edison had already faced a lot of lawsuits. To avoid any further litigation, Edison offered Swan to merge their companies. Swan agreed and the Edison and Swan Electric Light Company was formed, commonly known as the Edison Company. Inside Britain, the Edison company produced light bulb made with Swan's cellulose filament. While outside Britain, the actual Edison company continued to use the bamboo filament. That's why most of the world got to know Edison as the inventor of the light bulb. Although Swan's claims were upheld by the court, he was just another inventor whose name got lost behind the money and power of Edison. If you enjoyed the video, like, comment and share. 
If you like to learn the history of great inventions, subscribe to Procetus.